Hey, thanks for clicking on my video. If this video helps you, please consider liking this video and subscribing to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and it really helps. Let's get to the video. Hello everyone, in this video, we're gonna talk about how we can graph absolute value functions on our TI-84 Plus CE graphing calculator and also how we can just use the absolute value button if we wanted to just find, I don't know, the absolute value of negative five, uh, we could do that on our calculator. So let's figure out where the absolute value feature is. So to do that, we're just to examine the calculator screen um, we don't see absolute value listed on the home screen, so it has to be within a button somewhere. And so it is, it's, it's in the math button. So we click on math and we're gonna go right once to number or N-U-M. And it's just our first option there, ABS, that's absolute value. So if I hit enter, notice now it gives me my absolute value bars on my home screen. And like we said, we could just type in negative five and find the absolute value of negative five and we know that it's five, okay? So most likely you're probably not gonna be using absolute value for that feature. What you are gonna be using it for is to graph. So let's say we wanna graph an absolute value function. So once again, we're gonna go into y equals, but now this time, or this time we're going to y equals, but now once again, we wanna to go to math and go over to number and choose option number one for absolute value. Let's just say we wanna graph the parent function, which would just be the absolute value of x. We hit graph and there's our V-shaped graph, okay? Um, let's say we wanna graph maybe 2x, let's say we have 2x and then minus five in parentheses, we hit graph and there's our graph, okay? So that's how you can use the absolute value feature on your calculator to number one, just identify absolute value of a number, but probably more importantly to graph an absolute value function.